What's going on guys, Nick Hellman here, aka the Crypto Hitman, with a quick oatmeal update. I got the overnight oats. Trying it out, not too bad. High protein, check it out. But I wanted to quickly look at Coinbase. Coinbase pre-market valuing the company at over $189 a share after the big earnings beat at the close yesterday. We've seen some massive price action here. We are now at 44% on our personal new trading position. Outperforming ARK. ARK sold $34 million with the shares the past few days before this earnings. They didn't think they were going to beat earnings. They didn't think price action was going to do this. Now, we'll see what the general public and how they react to the opening here today. My last video, I said, if these earnings go well, which I think they will, and we get above these highs, you got new highs, blue skies, new highs. Blue skies, new highs usually causes FOMO and green bars. So pre-market opening above this would be nice. Bitcoin as well is up today, 52,296, up about a percent. And let's see what the stock futures are doing. Sorry, should have had this up, folks. Stock futures and Aztec is slightly green and the S&P and Dow are slightly red. So those are pretty neutral. So we'll see what happens today. We are still long. If this gets euphoric here, meaning above 200, we might be taking profits as we will be up over 50% on our trading position. And, you know, we like to be the ones selling for profits, not getting dumped on. This is a player versus player game here, folks. Coinbase, nonetheless, been doing very well for us, selling high, buying low over and over. Have patience up here, and we were right on the earnings call. So, let's see. This could get exciting for coin holders. Again, coin is making money off retailers, making money off institutions, making money by custodizing ETFs. Coinbase is now regulated, kind of the biggest show uh, around here in the United States at least. So U.S. demand for all coins, cryptos, and custodization of the ETF all produce more revenues for Coinbase. And that's what we see here today.